Welcome back to uh, Beyond All Reason. Uh, today we're going to do Mission 5, Testing the Waters. And it's been a while since I recorded. Last week I was I meant to do some last week, but I was just so busy and tired. I just didn't have time. So yeah, we're back back with the series. Um, so yeah, Testing the Waters. Test your skill in naval and aircraft warfare on one of the widest maps. You must defeat a single enemy who, like you, is still quite new to naval combat. So, I'm out of Cortex. Uh, I'd say Cortex are the strongest in naval and air combat. Uh, but you know, let's go Armada. That's for just the extra, extra little bit of challenge. Uh, loss, lose all my construction units. 30 minute estimate. Estimated resources, a million metal. Naval battles and barrel focus on interaction between the ships, submarines, hovercraft, aircraft, and occasionally amphibious units. We can use but we can use the Cortex Duck or the amphibious platypus, or the amount of platypus, experimental gantry of amphibious. Uh, Grand Sims for use nuclear missiles, so take care to defend yourself with either. Land nuclear missile defense or a mobile form of it. Or aircraft based. Uh oh, sorry, aircraft carrier based uh, anti nuke. Or flag we can use flagships or torpedo bombers. Same thing to destroy enemy units and resource spent. Kill the enemy commander. And I haven't done this one yet, so let's go. Yeah, it's been a while since I had the first four videos. I think I think I, quite, I enjoyed recording them. I don't know how. I really kept up to date on how well I've done. Um, like I said, I've been very busy. I plus I've got a mild nation to Victoria again. Good game, but it's very easy to get, get addicted to it. Okay, so we'll open up maybe with an air factory and transition to C. Then maybe bots later, so we'll start there. And lock position. Yeah, music was a bit loud. I was listening to it. Yeah, I was listening to it a little bit earlier. Oh yeah, air factory. So we need a lot of energy for an air factory. And a lot of metal for a naval lab. And I could open up with a bot lab. Then go to air. Cause we are, mm, actually, that's probably a better idea. Bots will have better, better build power. We'll open up with a bot lab. We're gonna have to clean the island, so we're gonna need air for air, air or a hovercraft platform for that. Hovercraft. You know what? Yeah, we'll go a hovercraft platform instead. Keep changing my mind, but I honestly don't get to use. I don't use hovercraft that often. And we'll build some more wind turbines. So we gotta get all the way over there, destroy everything. So when you build that, build those. Build a energy storage. We'll take it from there. First one out is probably gonna have to build build power. Because these things take a while to build. Or oh, to get my commander to assist the first one. I think go do the, do these and then do that. Do that there. Then more wind turbines. Keep the commander busy. Low power. Yeah, I know. Low power. We will solve that problem in a moment. Get that. Oh yeah, we're definitely running out of energy. That was a mistake. Actually, come on, I'll go grab that massive tree. That's 800 energy. That should get us going for a bit.
That's a big tree. I've got these trees are quite big. I quite have quite a lot of energy in them. It's good. Do we have a geothermal around here? Uh, no, no geothermal. Do that. Nope. And do that. So this one can go out and do all the metal extractors. So pretty sure we're going to get attacked at some point. Got to be careful. Pretty sure they'll target this area. That AI has a healthy upset, unhealthy obsession with hovercraft platforms itself. So maybe a couple of radars on the coastline. Get that belt. Get some uh, energy converters on the go. Just click that. I'm just clicking it. And that, space them out a bit. So we haven't really got a lot of build territory around here. Build space around here. It's probably a better way to start this mission. Don't need to sort our metal out. And we'll build some other tanks. Build some seekers and some crocodiles. Two seekers to one crocodile. Should be enough. That's taking some. You do that, then you do that. We could claim all this metal down here. Build these metal extractors underwater. Or metal points underwater. We've got plenty of energy. You're going to assist with that. That's great. We'll get some more metal coming out. Probably should have, maybe should have opened up with an air lab. Yeah, I don't often use hovercraft myself. But I've kind of slowed down playing multiplayer a little bit. I, I did play quite a lot of it, and honestly, I'm not very good. You're doing that, and you're done. I don't know if you can get up on here. Grab those. Build a radar, a beamer turret, and some a ch and a chainsaw. Oh, I forgot to unselect the hovercraft platform, but that's a good thing because we do actually need another constructor. Uh, start building. I just build amphibious units. Kind of want to build a build a navy as well. So we'll build a shipyard. Uh, right there. We could build naval based economy as well. Like, uh, economy, not combat. Uh, tunnel generators. Which is honestly a probably a good idea. But it's a constant flow in energy. Uh, of energy depends on map, yeah. But it's a constant. It's kind of like a solar panel. They produce a constant amount of energy. And then naval energy converters. So you're going to do that. When you've done that, you're going to build some naval build power. Oh, we keep tr uh, tr uh, chinning out units. Build one of those, and we'll build one of those. Keep our hovercraft assault force. Oh, your scouting force going. Getting plenty of energy, uh, plenty of metal now. Actually, surprisingly, a large amount. 
Are you making it up there? Nope, you can't make it up there. Okay. That is a surprise. Can the commander make it up there? So if you can get up there, you can get around there and do that. Still build a radar. I was surprised the hovercraft can't get up there. Low power. Oh, now we're running out of energy. And that's why. Because we don't have enough. So can you? Tells me a couple of advanced solars. The commander can make it up there. Aim some of these trees. I'm pretty sure they'll be launching an attack soon. We got uh, fast assault corvettes, assault frigates, destroyers, uh, resurrection subs. If we'll build one. Got a radar up. Oh, uh, we can see pretty far. Maybe we're trying to claim this like little little uh, rock outcropping too. Uh, why are you not doing anything? Reclaim. Reclaim button. Reclaim all that metal. Now, I could build a forward airbase on this island. Honestly, it might not be a bad idea. A couple of lazy towers to defend it, and then we'll build an airbase. An air factory. Honestly, we could probably get a T2. But there's no T2... Hovercraft, I don't, I don't believe. So, we'll go T2 Naval. I can find, oh, there you are. Uh, build a T2 Naval Shipyard, as we got the mail. You guys can reclaim the T1. We might as well go T2 Naval as we got the mail. How expensive is that actually? That is 3,200 mil. Put that on a repeat command. So as you go around and play more metal. So we did just run out of metal. Build more of these. Could do with a land base. T2 as well. Commander assist for that. I think I have a sizable attack force of hovercraft. Might take them over there. Build that. You can assist that. You're building more energy. Let's get more energy out as well. The more energy you got, the better. And you can convert it more. Need to assist with that then we'll reclaim that and then build a t2 air lab which then we'll use to upgrade our land-based metal, metal extractor point so reclaim so we could probably try and claim the other there as their second they've got an extra island though let's head over there Build an advanced air lab. Yeah, the metal for that. Did I build a? Yes, I did. I thought I built an advanced construction cell. Yes, not. Keep sending the hovercraft over. You are building our e base metal extractors. Keep going as well. Uh, while we build, I know, full of anti-airships, 
with a couple of paladins and a longbow. I don't have any energy. That's fine now. We are building the air lab, which is going to eat a lot of it. Looks like we've got no enemy encounters yet. Which honestly does actually have me a rather concerned. Then, is this aircraft is under attack? Have they really just sent an air? Oh, yeah, they have. Oh, they sent a scout. A. What? Oh, yeah, they actually have sent a hovercraft to attack us. Who's that? That's a skater. Go on, go over there and attack him. Oh, that means there's nothing. Oh, they've destroyed my hive by one. Advanced, uh, by my aircraft. Construction aircraft. Come on, get out of there. That's rude. I'm gonna have to. Oh, I can't rebuild that now. Oh, I did build her. Everyone's construction sub. Are we not able to kill that thing? Really? There we are. Oh, yes, we're gonna need another ship to get over here. Yeah, they destroyed my both my construction aircraft and my and one and one of my naval uh, construction ship. Rude. Well, this guy can come over here and reclaim this stuff, I guess. And they destroyed one of my my, my scout others. I hear more trouble. What's that? A dolphin. It's on ships. Okay. They just, they just completely bypassed my, my assault. Okay. Getting sneaky. Oh. Sure. My paladin should be able to deal with that. Uh, we'll also build... I'll build a naval engineer. Yeah, they're just going around. A couple of advanced aircraft. Hopefully this time they won't get shot down. Thank you. Build the I did. I'll build a Voyager. Which is... Ooh, that's interesting. Rocket Fire Plasma Tower. That's new. I haven't seen that one before. I guess we should probably build one. I think that, yeah, they're... Trying to go around us. Commander. Right, you over here and build all our mechs. Would you kindly? And you build a second one. We're kind of scrambling to uh, react now. I'd like to build an epoch, but I'm not going to. I'm also going to build a, a haven. A long range radar coverage. Right, you're going to build me a fusion reactor. But you're going to do it over here. Two fusion reactors. But they've completely ignored this group here and went straight from my base. Which is fine. I send two ships over there, which are two pardons. Another one coming out now. 
and El Haven. Which I could uh, I should probably build two havens. One for here, one for the front line. What shall we build? Gunships? I'm not too familiar with the uh, uh, Armada Air. I don't play Armada Air very often. We're going to have radar coverage from the ship. So, I think we build some gunships. My commander deal with it. Oh, we have a naval presence. That's going to take a while. Because I sent all my hovercraft to build other things. Oh, actually, you can come over here and build some build power. Build the build. Go ahead and launch an attack. All right, where is the first haven? There you are. Oh, you've got some decent range. Now, uh, I could go for a epoch, or even a dreadnought. It's a battleship, but it's called a Dreadnought. What weapons do you have? Oh, you, oh, you do have depth charge launchers too. If I'm going to attack, I'm going to attack with overwhelming force, if possible. Right, the first second haven can stay here. We'll cancel both of those two. T2 unit detected. What was that? That well, was it just got absolutely annihilated. Didn't stand a chance. No, there's some, there's a, they're actually sending platypus, so it's uh, Armada. Yeah, we're going to need more ships. Let's build some maelstroms. It looks like, yeah, they're just... I think anti air bots after it. You know, I think it's time we launch an attack. Oh no. We're even sending tumbleweeds. They're, they're sending everything after us, maybe. Take me some cruisers down here. Oh, I sent a couple. A sub. Yeah, we need some cruisers down here. Because they're attacking my my haven. It's kind of descending into chaos, this, doesn't it? Right, let's kill that. Knock out their naval production. You come back this way. I don't need too many of these. So, we don't need those. We're actually going to build Dreadnought as well. Everything to the front line. Oh, oh crap. You know what? Cancel those, those, those. Just build rocket launchers. That was a. Oh. Did I not build any planes? Oh, I forgot to set them to repeat. I 
Okay, these are sniper bots. And plasma. Alright, we need some long range firepower. So, we'll also build. Just go and build an e bot. Uh, and another fusion reactor. So we've got plenty of energy. We'll keep reclaiming all the metal around here. Move around there and attack them from this side. Yeah, those sniper bots, they're, they're actually using sniper bots to destroy my ships. Clever. Where's my Dreadnought? There she is. Well, she called a Dreadnought. It's actually a battleship class. That's not to question it. I mean, I could go... Let's go bots ourselves. Where's that? Oh, there. That's their anti-air ship. Uh, anti-air garbage. Where did my missile ships go? They all destroyed. They killed my missile ships. That's rude. Well, I need more than then. Yeah, they actually destroyed all my missile ships. And we are slowly building up some roughneck. Yeah, I don't need to produce any more paladins. Yeah, missile ships on my epoch. And maybe another dreadnought. Uh, T1 bot. Let's build some of these. Some metal. Advanced metal. Advanced energy converters. I keep calling them metal makers because that's what they're called on. Uh... Total annihilation. I, I, I even got that just then. You reclaim that. And then build a T2 lab. And if they're going to send uh, amphibious bots, we're going to send amphibious. What's your attack range? A lot bigger than the. Uh, what are they called? The Pardons. So the epoch should be done soon. Now I'll pretty much end the game. But what weapons do you have? Just your long range gun, uh, guns. You, you're going to assist that. You're going to assist that. We're going to build. What are they? Platypus. We're going to send them all the way over and do to them what they were doing to us. Man, those sniper bots. I love the sniper bots. They do so much damage. Give them enough vision, they'll destroy anything. Here she comes. Here comes the flagship. I don't know, I don't know if I like the platypus or the duck. Uh, the duck is a core, is the uh, cortex one. They really just. Oh my god, they sunk my flagship. That's just straight up rude. Right. 
What's the range on this thing? Uh, not bad, but not enough to hit the coastline. It actually destroyed my flagship. Uh, my flagship. Oh, Food. All right. Guess we should be able to build another one. Here comes the swarm. <laughs> What? I don't think it's hitting us. Do a little construction on the graph. Right, you're done with your job. We're going to assist that. You're done with your job, but guess what? You get to build more. Build me some more. Let's just go nuts. You know what I should probably build? Just in case. If I can find it, combat and anti nuke. I think somebody, said, somebody uh, described the Flaps of the Duck as the best submarine in the game. And it's not even a submarine. What's your combat range? Yeah, this base is done for. But. Epoch's going to destroy everything. We've got full radar coverage. Pretty sure. There we go. He's firing. The pinnacle of Armada Navy. I didn't need these rocket uh, hoppers, but I built them anyway. Uh, kind of too many. Let's stop building them. <laughs> uh, let's build rocket hours instead. That will launch our, la our grand invasion. Pretty sure. Yeah, I built two uh, long ways. I think the Cortex version is the messenger. I believe. Well, let's build a because we can. I'm going to build another epoch because I can. If I can. They can stop me. Oh, they got black boys. Wow. Okay, that's a lot of firepower. That's a lot of firepower. Don't shoot the messenger. No, shoot the messenger, don't shoot Plumber. What is that? Unidentifiable unit. We shall have our revenge for destroying my battleship. Advanced construction is up. Uh, more male extractors, as we're pretty much unopposed at this point. We wiped out their naval capabilities fairly early on. Dreadnought. Let's move you forward as well. No, my uh, the Voyager can actually build more platypus and skaters. Oh, it's a ship that can build more ships. Um, what a gorgon. No, I don't need it.
So you guys can do over there. I'll work on attacking this section. Working on, on another epoch, which I probably don't need, but I'm going to build anyway, because... Why not? Yeah, I think their coastline's pretty much destroyed. Let's go up here. Do we have radar range up there? Yes, we do. We have full radar coverage of their, of their side now. Oh, yeah, there, they're rolling bombs. Tumbleweed. Yeah, the plays are a bit faster, I think, compared to the duck. Down the coastline. Well, they built up pretty quickly. Okay, yeah, that, that's a lot. That was a lot of missile hovercraft. I did not need to build. I built them anyway. Oh, they, I think they've got a pulsar there as well. Yeah, that's a force we're probably going to be able to be. They did destroy quite a lot of those hovercraft. More's coming out. Our economy is flying now. Push them all. Reinforcements have arrived. Well, at least the uh, epochs are still firing. Here comes the second one. Yeah, here comes another one. I think you're more interesting in, in attacking this side than defend than anything. I wish that Voyager could build a. Oh, can you build? Oh, you can't build a hovercraft factory. Apparently. And they, they do have radar jamming, so we can't target that yet. Bring that down. Okay, where did they come from? They snuck a horse just right around. Oh, just grunts. Oh, so Grunts that were attacking us on the front line here, but then they backed off. Right, reinforcements. Maybe what a couple of bar uh, dreadnought, uh, super bar ships can do, or flagships in this case. Did we? Uh, nope, never got that finished. I mean, I could build T3, I don't think it's worth it at this point. 
Nah. Well, let's mass off shot bombard them. Oh, something big just went out. Hey there, Commander. Lock on and destroy. Oh, missile boats are too far away. Hey, you've got two two epochs firing you. I think the best chance you've got is to kiss your ass goodbye. Just like that. Oh, killing him didn't. Uh, well, I think we've definitely got over time. I have no idea how much metal we produced until we're finished. That's it, it's over. Oh, they built, they built a cloakable fusion reactor, do they? Oh, an imprint. Oh yeah, they did, they actually built a cloaked fusion reactor. It's no longer cloaked because it's no longer a fusion reactor. There we go. Took longer than I expected. Took uh, 39, almost 40 minutes. But quite a fun battle. Oh, I'll update that because that's an update here. Testing the waters. It's 417,000 metal. So I hit them way below the metal requirement. But took 10 minutes longer than I expected. Still. Quite a good, quite a good mission that one. I mean, I, I think I said before, I would definitely recommend doing these missions if you're new to the game. It gives you, you know, teaches you how to play certain roles. Like this one is a naval role. Um, this one's more of a team role. This one gives you a bit of a buff at the start, so you figure things out. This tells you how to attack. But that'll be the uh, this video. It was a little bit longer than I planned. Um, but yeah. I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.